Sometimes after a long day of exploring, you get to camp, get your campfire going, and all you want is a nice steak cooked over the fire. Other times, you might just want a warm, hearty soup. If you're anything like me, you probably want both. Today though, we're making the super simple potato cauliflower soup. We'll be roasting all the vegetables right in the campfire. The ingredients list for this is pretty simple. You want the vegetables, you want some broth or stock to make your soup, maybe some cream and cheese to thicken it and make it really hearty. But the vegetables, you can do anything you want. We're using potatoes, cauliflower, carrots, and some mushrooms today. Since we're roasting the veggies in the campfire, you want to start off by chopping them pretty small. To make the aluminum foil pouches that we're going to throw in the campfire, lay out a sheet of aluminum foil flat. Add your vegetables to the center of the packet, and then we'll seal it up. It's probably a better idea to make two packets here instead of trying to overfill one, because you really want to make sure you get the packet sealed well to trap in all the steam and goodness that's going to cook those vegetables. To make the aluminum foil pouches, fold the edges up towards each other and roll them a couple of times to make sure you get a really good seal. Again, since we're roasting these vegetables right in the campfire, you're going to want to make sure you get your fire started early to get a good bed of coals going. The key to any campfire cooking is a nice bed of hot coals to work with. Now that we've got the campfire ready, we'll just go ahead and toss our aluminum foil pouch right into the fire. We'll let these vegetables roast for about 15 to 20 minutes, rotating them a couple of times throughout. While the vegetables are roasting in the campfire, we'll go ahead and get the rest of the soup going. Grab your two burner stove and your pot and add some vegetable stock to get it heating up. When your vegetables are ready, go ahead and pull them out of the campfire carefully and bring them over to your stove. Open up the aluminum foil and add the vegetables to the pot. Make sure you get everything out of your aluminum foil packet because that's all just going to add flavor and deliciousness to the soup we're making. We'll want to go ahead and have everything simmering in the pot now so we can add our spices and just let everything sort of blend together and become really flavorful. And at this point I'll go ahead and use my wooden spoon or spatula and sort of start to break down some of the potatoes and cauliflower and kind of mash them almost. Uh, we're not going for super creamy or anything, but it's nice to play with the textures a little bit. To really take this soup to the next level, we're also going to use our campfire and our cast iron skillet to make some croutons to go over the top. I guess it's basically just toasting bread. Uh, we used some of this Asiago sourdough loaf, tore it up into small pieces, put just a little bit of butter in the pan, and then threw it directly on the campfire. Just keep the bread moving and it'll toast up real nice. Now to finish the soup off, we can add some cheese, some heavy cream, or leave it out if you, if you don't want to do dairy. And all that's left is to serve it up in your bowl, add some croutons, and enjoy. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel to follow along as we go on more adventures and try out more camp recipes. But until next time, get out and explore somewhere.